Now, currently, the only national, and I mean the only national political party that is left in Kenya, the only political party that qualifies to conduct elections across the country is William Ruto's UDA party because it has the highest number of MPs across the country. Our politics are very local and that is why there are also some small political parties that represent the interest of their own people the interest of their own regions, the interest of their communities to the government. Like for instance, in the Ukambani region, we have the Waipa political party that belongs to Kalonzo Musioka, who is also considered as the kingpin of the Ukambani region. In the Western region, we have political parties like the ANC, DAP and Ford Kenya. So the question is, is Raila Odinga's ODM party very quickly becoming the Luo political party to represent the interest of the Luo community to the government? I'm asking this because of the severe defections that is looming the defection that is caused by a fallout, political war, divisions over who exactly will be the next ODM party leader. That is Raila Odinga's big headache currently, causing Raila Odinga's frustrations. Let me read for you this article here which says, Raila Odinga's desperate bid to defuse ODM war. It proceeds to say that Raila Odinga is considering to have Wycliffe Oparanya to lead the ODM party and to be deputized by Ali Hassan Joho and Opio Wandai. We all know democratically the ODM party leader must be elected but Raila Odinga does not want elections to be done, to be conducted. He just wants it to be done through a consensus. Why do you think Raila Odinga does not want elections to be conducted? Because Raila Odinga understands, knows very well, that if elections will be conducted, Ali Hassan Joho will win. He will defeat Oparanya. And remember that, Raila Odinga's choice through the consensus, he wants Wycliffe Oparanya to be the party leader. Now, that is where the problem starts. Ali Hassan Joho, who is very angry at the moment, has attacked Raila Odinga directly over this matter. So let me read for you the statement that Ali Hassan Joho directed to Raila Odinga. But before that, just a quick reminder that if you are listening to me and you haven't subscribed, maybe it's your first time in this channel, I'm requesting you to please just take a second or two and subscribe down below. You can also give this video a like so that YouTube can recommend this channel and this video in particular to reach out to others. I also want to take this opportunity to really, really appreciate my returning subscribers. Without your support, this channel cannot be where it is, and that is why I don't take your support for granted. Thank you so much. Having said that, now let us go straight into the details. This is the message from Ali Hassan Joho to Raila Odinga. Ali Hassan Joho says, There are people in ODM who are calling me, saying, I am going too fast, and that I should go for talks. I'm not talking to anyone. We will talk on the ballot box when it comes. So you can clearly tell that Ali Hassan Joho is saying no to Raila Odinga over 
the consensus if Raila Odinga will play Ali Hassan Joho on this issue which will happen of course i want to assure you that Ali Hassan Joho will definitely quit the ODM party i was talking to you about the ODM party being a luo political party it is not about tribe it is about the language of the luos in ODM party their main language is baba akisema amesema baba is supreme baba is final so there is no one who qualifies no one in ODM who qualifies to oppose Raila Amolodinga so let me read for you this statement by the ODM party chairman John Badi who is warning Ali Hassan Jo against opposing Raila Amolodinga and he is defending Raila Odinga's decision to endorse Oparanya so John Badi is saying that I appeal to our people those who want to lead and those who simply want the party to remain strong to exercise caution underline the word restraint and moderation what does that mean you can find out so the luo nyanza region leaders will never ever oppose raila odinga raila is final so the question is why do you think raila odinga is endorsing oparanya why do you think raila odinga is rejecting ali hassan joho to lead the party i will still do another critical analysis on why raila odinga is rejecting ali hassan joho but the reasons are as follows number one, raila odinga cannot trust ali hassan joho ali hassan joho cannot be trusted why because oparanya stood with baba all along since raila odinga lost the elections where was ali hassan joho during that time during the demonstrations across the country oparanya was very much present where was ali hassan joho so on matters loyalty the person that can be trusted between ali hassan joho and oparanya Raila Odinga will definitely go for Oparanya. Number two, Ali Hassan Joho's character. Just compare the characters between Ali Hassan Joho and Oparanya. Who do you think is the best choice for Raila Odinga? Ali Hassan Joho's mistake is to oppose Raila Odinga. That is the first mistake that he's committing, which is unacceptable in ODM rules. Oparanya is someone who says yes sir that is Raila Odinga's choice Raila Odinga is final and finally is that Joho can be swayed you know Joho is still young energetic in fact i categorize Joho with politicians like Babu Owino Jalango and those young leaders they have money they have the popularity but they can be used Raila Odinga understands very well that ODM will not be in safe hands with Joho and Raila Odinga understands William Ruto very well William Ruto is not someone you can joke with when it comes to political parties so Ali Hassan Jo can take the ODM party to the highest bidder. On Raila Odinga's side, it is not all about money. It is all about protecting the party. So that is it, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what you think. I would also want to know your thoughts and your opinions over this matter in the comment section down below. Otherwise, I don't have much. Let me see you again in my next video analysis, but please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. My name is Jason. Bye bye. Have a good night.